how do you feel like that one went for you guys tonight? Well, I think we played great uh, for the most part. I think you know a lot better, a lot better effort. Um, you know, just staying in the game and um, playing hard and getting defensive stops and running. And I think you know we, we made a, a step in the right direction today. Oh, sure. We, I, we talked a little bit about kind of the way things have been defending you, and then to come out tonight, and it seems like they pretty much a single covered you for the most part. What, what did you think about the other day? Yeah, I think it was more of a you know like the normal, like how uh, like how um, the Suns were playing in the first quarter. Um, they were playing like at the touch and then kind of backing up a little bit. So, um, you know, I was able to get to my spots and I've, I've seen that one before. So I know, you know, what times I can get a shot off and um, what times I could be aggressive and, and make plays. So um, they wasn't, you know, as aggressive as the Suns were for sure. Uh, what, what do you think of the, of trying to key on tonight? Uh, <clears throat> no, I, I mean, I'll say Keon's very talented and, um, you know, just trying to help him and put him in positions to, you know, play to his strengths. He started off, you know, making three threes in a row. So um, that helped him get going a little bit, get his confidence going. You know, he started driving to the basket, kicking out, and he, you can see the confidence in him growing and during the game, talking more to me, um, you know, saying what, what, what plays we want to run and he, him calling out his plays himself. So um, it was good to see him play with that much confidence and, um, you know, get better today. Uh, 40 minutes tonight for you. Right? You took quite a few shots. Which how, how are you feeling physically? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, just, I mean, just trying to get used to, you know, playing that much. Um, yeah, definitely, definitely, you know, one of the toughest things, like, to deal with, like, you know, physically and um, conditioning-wise, just kind of trying to pace yourself throughout the game, um, knowing that you're going to be there, be in the game a lot. So, um, you know, just, just getting used to it and, you know, keep going playing through it. I imagine too, like I mean, that's a lot of minutes in general, but especially for someone who draws a lot of attention from the defense, like that, that probably has to take it out of you a bit to, to be kind of the, the guy that you're keying in on. No, for sure. Just you know, just trying to find ways to make it easier on yourself, especially like if Brandon's in the game, can it get him on the ball, let him be aggressive for a while, and um, and then when it's time to you know if we need a bucket, then that's when I go out and be aggressive and try to make a play. So kind of finding the the balance in between of you know. You know, being me and playing, being aggressive and having the ball in my hands, and then you know letting everybody else who can handle the ball, you know, go and, and play play their game as well. Were you trying to get some quick offense tonight? It seemed like there were a couple of times when like it looked like you were looking for your shot quickly, maybe to, to keep the defense off balance or, or yeah, for sure. That's like one of the things. Like um, you know, just obviously when I come up picking rolls, I don't want to be you know trapped every time. So I'm just trying to figure out a way to kind of go before it gets there and. Um, you know, try to try to keep the defense off balance. You know, especially like they know I'm coming off the screen every time. That, you know, this it's going to be easy from the garden. But if I you know reject or you know go before the screen, it kind of keeps them off balance. And you know, when I want to go off the screen, I'll get a little bit more separation. You mentioned Brandon as well. But what do you think is one thing? Like I do that. Like it seems like hard to stay in front of him. No, Brandon's great. I mean, you know, you hear a lot of stuff about him when he was playing in the G League, like. And like he was, you know, the best point guard by far. So um, him seeing him play it, say you, you see like, you know, how good he is. He's really good and can do a lot of things. Can shoot the ball, can drive the ball, can you know dish out for for shots. And um, you know, it's been good to see him play and, and you know out there and you know play very well tonight. Take a couple from the Zoom. Uh, Aaron Petrus, go ahead. Hey, Aaron, I'm just curious. Given the last three games, a lot of players scores, and then how you guys played well in the first quarter and then kind of played physically. Was it good for? No, for sure. Just um, that's kind of the, the message I kind of coach has been telling him. I've been telling him like, you know, just you know, the last couple of games we've been playing very well. The first sec first quarter and kind of you know go down here from there. And um, you know, this game we're trying to emphasize and like you know have good a good four quarters and um, give us a chance to win. So um, I think we did that tonight. Staying in the game, um, having leads, making runs, and sustaining their runs as well, for the most part. So, um, you know, I've been proud of that. Okay. Christos Holtis. Let me let's go quickly through the guys. How far do you sign more spot leaders, despite the absences? How far do you sign both for the team and for you personally? Um, it's, like I said, it's very, you know, very fun to play. You know, with a lot of young guys and see. You know them. You know, gain a lot of confidence and and grow. You know, and get better each and every game. And so, 
Um, it's been fun. Like I've been kind of pushing to like a like a, a real leadership role and real mentor role. So, um, you know, I'm just trying to take full advantage of it. Try to, you know, get better at those stuff, at, at those things, and um, just continue to grow with with the players. Um, you know that we have playing. So um, all the young guys and just it's gonna be a fun, you know, fun last winning games to see them, you know, mature into, you know, the players they they can be. So, um, you know, I think. It, you know, keep going forward, just continue to get better each and every game.